small town barbecue joint. And now News 3 reporter Anthony Sabella is going vegan with Caribbean flair. He is live in Virginia Beach. I'm curious to know more about this place. Yeah, you know, we're kind of doing a 180 from the beginning of this morning. I'm at a place called Desmond's Island Soul Grill. It's right off of Indian River near I-64 on a street called Rion Drive here in Virginia Beach. The folks here call themselves, and are you ready for this, a Guyanese-influenced vegan Caribbean restaurant. So lots of titles there, lots going on inside too. Siobhan Alexander opened this place with her friend Will Riddick almost three years ago. The two met while uh, studying at Culinary Institute of Virginia. The name comes from Alexander's dad, Desmond, who passed away about 20 years ago. Her parents are from Guyana, which is a country on the South American Caribbean coast. And now she's bringing their food and more to Hampton Roads. Desmond's Island went full vegan late last year, and Alexander says it was going really well serving favorites like Rasta pasta and arepas. Once the coronavirus outbreak hit, though, she and Riddick closed the dining room, and now they're offering takeout and doing everything they can to stay open. One, because they know there really aren't many full vegan options available here in this area, and two, because of the people that helped them get to this point. My mom, my aunts, my cousins, everybody cook. I learned hospitality and cooking from my mom. She'll open her door to anyone. Um, so I learned that from my mom. And why I'm getting emotional now is because my aunt passed uh, uh, two Saturdays ago, New York. Um, and she was, ah, oh, sorry. Any kind of event, any kind of, any kind of um, celebration or funerals, she cooked. She cooked massive meals. My mom's been in motorcycle clubs since she was, since like 83. Oh, awesome. Birthdays, uh, holidays, parties, like anything, uh, my mom was also cooking. So you can tell they got some real at home cooking here, influence from their moms, their aunts, and they know the word vegan can scare some folks, but they stand by their food made to order with all kinds of seasonings and spices, really, really delicious stuff. I'm told Alexander tells me she has customers of all kinds coming into folks who eat those plant based diets, but also folks who eat meat too. She and Riddick are, of course, very grateful for support, but we want to get them even more support. That's what Takeout Tuesday is all about. So Desmond's Island Soul Grill, again, opened here on Rion Drive. It's open Tuesday through Saturday for lunch and dinner. They also keep up on social media. If you want more information on that, we put their contact info and uh, specific hours on our website, WTKR.com. We've also put the info for all of the places we visited earlier today. You know, like we've been saying week after week, if you have the means you really want to go out and you want to support these local restaurants. They really need your help right now with all of the restrictions that are in place to prevent the spread of COVID-19. Any little bit of uh, business revenue helps these restaurants so they can be there even after all of this is over. Again, we have more information on WTKR.com. We're live here in Virginia Beach. Anthony Sabella, News 3.